iPhone metering is a notable addition to macOS Secure and iOS 18. What makes it super handy is the ability to let you use your iPhone on your Mac. Yeah, you got that right. You can now access and use your iPhone right on your Mac and even drag and draw files between your iOS and macOS device seamlessly. That said, let's get it started. So first and foremost, make sure to check off all the important requirements. As the iPhone mirroring is a continuity feature, it requires you to use the same Apple ID on your Mac and iPhone. Additionally, ensure that Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and two-factor authentication are enabled on your devices. Bear in mind that iPhone mirroring can't be used when Sidecar and AirPlay are activated. On top of all, know that your iPhone must be running iOS 18 Beta 2 or later and your Mac must be equipped with Mac or Secure Beta 2 or later. Once you have taken care of all the important requirements, lock your iPhone and place it near your Mac. Then you have to click on the iPhone icon in your Mac dock and authenticate. When prompted, make sure to verify by entering the passcode on your iPhone. Once that's done, you are all set. Now go ahead and use your iPhone on your Mac. As I have just said, you can take advantage of this brand new feature to open up and use apps and even take control of notifications. Later, if you want to disable iPhone mirroring, just right click on the iPhone icon in the dock and then choose quit in the menu and that's pretty much it. So that's so you can easily enable or disable iPhone mirroring in iOS 18 and Mac OS 15. Secure. If I found this video helpful, do like and share it, and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye. -bye.